Hey everyone, this is Larry with Today I Feel Like. A couple years ago, I made a video about how to install a VPN on the Apple TV. And it was a little complicated because it involved loading a VPN on your router and then using it with your Apple TV. Well, Apple has just made things a whole lot simpler. So let me show you how to install a VPN on your Apple TV in 2024. All right, let's jump into it and here we go. All right, here we are on my Apple TV. Let me just show you how quick and easy it is to get a VPN now. We're just gonna head over to the App Store. And from the App Store, we're just gonna search for one of our favorite VPNs because they're allowed in the App Store now. So I'm gonna go ahead and search for ExpressVPN. And there we have it right there. And you can see I actually already have it installed. And so I can just go ahead and click Open. And there it is, just right there, ready to go. So now if I go ahead and click connect, we can see now that I am connected to my VPN in the UK. So now I can come back here and let me see, let me go back, there we go. And now I can come over to say the BBC iPlayer. And there we go, I am now signing in. And just like that, I can come over here and I can watch whatever I wanna watch from the BBC iPlayer. So if I wanna watch something like this Bad Education, I can click that, hit the play button. There we go, it's loaded up and working. So pretty quick, pretty painless. And there's other VPNs in the App Store as well. You can come back over here, go into the App Store. And one of my favorite VP, one of my other favorite VPNs, and let me just see if I can uh, go ahead and search for it. I'm just gonna type in, uh, let me get rid of that E. And let me just type in VPN. And you can see there's a whole bunch of different ones like NordVPN, um, XVPN, Leap, all kinds of different ones. But this is my second favorite one right here, which is IP Vanish. And you can go ahead and download that right onto your device. And now you'll see it says open. It's gonna give you some stuff about privacy. And then you just need to simply log in with your username and password that you normally would if you were on your phone or your computer or your tablet. And it will work right here on your Apple TV. Now just one quick tip about this is that some apps may not work if you are using a VPN and some apps will work differently if you're using a VPN. So just make sure once you're done using it, go back into your VPN and actually disconnect it. That way you don't have any issues that you're, unex that you're not expecting to have when you start using various apps. All right, that's it. As you can see, it was very quick and very easy to install a VPN on your Apple TV now in 2024. Apple finally allowed VPNs in the App Store for the Apple TV. So it is fantastic. It really does make your life a whole lot easier when you want to navigate around apps that are coming from different countries or maybe take a look at a different country's Netflix uh, catalog. It just really makes life easier being able to have a VPN on your Apple TV and to be able to do it quickly and easily without having to install it on a router or do some other roundabout way of getting it to work. So there you go. Anyways, if you need a VPN, I'm gonna leave links down in the video description for both uh, ExpressVPN and IPVanish. Those are my two favorite VPNs that I use on a fairly regular basis. And I think you will find there are some fantastic deals so that you can get them for very, very cheap. So there you go. All right. I'm gonna leave links to everything down below. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Also, please subscribe to this channel and follow me on Instagram. And I am Larry with Today I Feel Like. Thanks for coming back to see me. Come back and see me soon. And until next time, love, peace, and hair grease. Peace. <laughs>